everybody welcome to let's play silver journals 2 right now we are at winchester virginia it's i think fourth battle in the valley campaign for stonewall jackson and uh, yeah it seems to be um really interesting place once again surrounded by hills and um now we have to we have basically an enemy right in front of us we were able to manage to march under their noses possibly through fog or some other um, bad weather um, so that we can just attack them right away from the first turn and it's going to be really pitch battle from the get-go um, and it seems that we have these two guys now um, on the field because we are now I guess controlling brigade or even the core level of army so these guys are now active on the field um, before these guys are supposed to be the general that was actually uh, commanding the pieces but now we are general that is um, a bit higher I guess in authority than them so that's why they are in the field moving around and we have Stonewall Jackson here and uh, Ewell, R.S. Ewell and I think that's it and um, yeah and we have all these hills in front of us we have all these entrenched positions a lot of cannons entrenched and I guess set to hit us this position and also here as well because as you can see uh, our own cannons which are really numerous to begin with um, this is more than I can actually ever handle or even know what to do with um, yeah so we have a lot of cannons here as well and we are able to just duel with these guys um, pretty much and we have a lot more guys than them right now from what we can see but of course they bring some reinforcements as well uh, we have reinforcements too as you can see i guess the battle starts in the morning six o'clock as the time progresses we receive one at nine o'clock which is i guess fifth or sixth turn and once again at ten o'clock and all the way continuing up to 12 o'clock in the afternoon and the battle is consisting of 24 turns so yeah it's going to be pretty involved right from the get-go as you can see we are uh, right under the noses i don't know how we were able to march uh, all the way so that we are so close to them uh, maybe there was like some heavy fog or some bad weather that they didn't notice but well i mean yeah we have to get going and then punch a hole and i think the objectives report said that i need to flank Try to capture this area first be in the middle and then push forward toward winchester and there's some hills nearby as well and you can see that this map is not that large uh, it's going to involve a whole lot of men but not that large um, and i guess we need to use some reinforcements to uh, break through to winchester and the victory points will signify where we should end up at least as you can see uh, winchester proper has the most amount of victory points followed by this hill okay so i think our first objective is to capture this hill and then try to um, prevent these guys from attacking us or endangering our men and you can see the firepower is a whole lot larger and there's some generals on the field and a whole lot of men with higher firepower assigned I mean, it doesn't seem like a whole lot of men uh, compared to last battle but the firepower is like really um really a solid upgrade i mean i didn't upgrade these guys but they seem to come with some really good weapons and also i can yeah also same can be said for the enemy as well they have all these muskets that would be pretty dangerous especially up close and uh, 44 firepower yeah look at that yeah they have 714 men, definitely more men than us, so we need to be very careful in the respect. And um, the weapons are, I think these guys are meant for like charging charging us, while we are more, um, as you can see by the ranged attack, 65 to 38, more kind of lay back and then uh, try to defend while the cannons do the work to whittle these guys down. The cannon up top of the hill is a pretty good, very robust artillery regiment. So um, really need to start off with the artillery and then there's going to be fuel here and uh, yeah alright so we didn't suffer that much but 
I mean, be very prepared to go and then face them. Um, and then really, there's no... I mean, these guys could just go up north and try to go Winchester, but right now we have these guys to contend with. And um, don't have a lot of men, I think, to spam toward Winchester. We need to be hands on deck here, all hands on deck here, try to um, defeat these guys. Okay, so checking out the height and natural cover and all that. Yeah, so these guys are really powerful. This guy and this guy. And uh, we have some comparable strength guys too. Uh, this guy is in the, stuck in the middle. They're not going to really end up well if I leave them be. So, um, yeah, I think these guys could also all uh, form the formation and try to come up. Now the... Yeah, it's going to be disadvantaged a bit because of the fact that um, they're in the lower ground, so I'm not going to attack right now. And just um, pull this guy so that they don't damage us as much. And yeah, these guys too, 44 and 31. This is going to be very dangerous. Really dangerous. And um, of course, yeah, these guys will be very dangerous as well, which is where these guys will come in or these guys uh, I think they're able to aim at some of these guys yeah so I think right from the get-go we need to use this uh, emplacement in order to fire these guys there's no question about that I'm just trying to see the natural cover and the like yeah so natural cover right so we can do well in placing some of these guys in here to try to block these guys from coming over I don't think they can easily cross over the stream or the creek or they'll be disadvantaged a bit more than they would be worthy to cross the bridge um, and then prepare cover let's check out the prepare cover yeah they're all well prepared well set especially these guys so I'm worry about taking them directly although I can move certain guys especially this guy um, but then the yeah cover is not that great so and I guess I can set up the, yeah, I can set up right here, or if I can go here, it'd be nice. Yeah, and then I can set up the area here so that these guys will be benefited from having a U-Wall around. Yeah, you can see the bonus here. I think it applies to our artillery as well. So let's continue uh, with following these guys. I think they did U-Wall once again. We lost out there, and I'm going to continue. And these two guys, I try to aim at this guy, who's surely to attack uh, one of these and then uh, drive us out. So I'm not going to allow these guys to be attacked at the same time. But I'm going to move these guys to um, perhaps here, the second line of defense. And I'm going to attack these guys. Kind of eliminate their threat and then continue with this uh, bombardment and um, take these guys, these guys. Okay, so we have TJ Jackson here. I think he'd be more useful on this side, on this side of the this side of the map because there's really no general overseeing these guys. But well, let's just continue with this um, bombardment of the cannons first they're just ready made to wow this really okay wow okay so they definitely have us within their range so it's going to be um very much uh they didn't shoot back okay so that's interesting thing they didn't shoot back why they range of nine maybe because we are kind of in a secluded area it's a pretty good area to set up your artillery and it looks like uh, we need to get these cannons up these hills uh, where these guys are in order to fire at them and let's just check here 31 to 26 i think i can manage to um, kind of uh, bottle these guys here in this bridge if i move quickly to the toll house and you can see our um, mr banks promissory banks leader 86 81 86 not bad at all okay 
All right, so let's continue on uh, with moving these guys in the center of the line. And these guys will move. Um, well, if I move right here, okay. Yeah, I can. Um, can actually set up here and then fire at this guy. But if I come up here, maybe I will to also fire. Yeah, let's see if I, let's see if I can move here and then. Oh, okay. I need to probably undo because um, it's not a good area to fire. Maybe I should just move uh, these guys right here. But now, okay. Um, yeah, I guess I can try to fire this guy. Yeah, and okay, so I'm gonna move this guy up here. Oh, not that guy, but yeah, I'm gonna move this guy and maybe. Okay, yeah, uh, I'm fine with that. So let's set up. All right, these guys are not that powerful, but I think they need to be well prepared to march in formation or in battle formation because they are under the threat of artillery. I don't know about these guys. Yeah, they're pretty, uh, yeah, they're kind of blocked off. I'm gonna undo, undo formation change. All right. Okay, so this guy could direct set up his HQ right here or he can try to go here and then um, provide guidance from this side okay so let's see if I can go there and let you all handle things over here um, and bring his all his uh, good attributes as you can see is he affected somewhat so all right I think I moved everybody. Yeah. Okay, so I can probably uh, set up this guy. Um, yeah, let's check the... Okay, five, five. All right. Yeah, there's really nothing I can do here. Uh, maybe there will be more um, troops try to cross. Maybe I should um, try to dig in though. Yeah, maybe I should try to dig in. Can I dig in? Nope, I cannot dig in. Alright. Alright then, I'll try to leave that guy over there. And I'm gonna try to dig in here. Yeah, right. Okay, so turn this over. Let's continue and uh, we are getting hit. Okay, that's pretty bad. Yeah. Yeah, so there's concentrated fire on that guy. Um, yeah, might be pushed out. They were pushed out there. They charged at us. That was pretty bad. And we were pushed out, I think. Or did we, did we hold? Okay, we held. Wow. Okay. <laughs> that was pretty surprising. Alright, so Banks kind of left, I guess, to prepare defenses over at the Winchester area. Now, this guy is not really doing well, so we need to uh, definitely get out of that. Bring these guys back. First of all, um, let's see if I can make some positive change over at the hills here. Um, yeah, okay. I need to probably bombard these guys a bit more. And there's a guy coming in from the north. So that could change a lot of things. Yeah, that's not good. So let's continue and get the hill first. Yeah, let's get the hill first. I think that's our priority. out couldn't do it unfortunately these guys will have to protect this area though oh my goodness look at them appearing out of wow look at that yeah they're like messing a lot of troops here so okay so what to do with that i need to run to um let's see if i can run a bit more here yeah leave my wound there they're sagging in a way but uh yeah i mean could be pretty dangerous Right. Let's 
see, 24. All right, yeah, so um, it's going to be pretty bad if I do not um, take care of these things or in a quick fashion. Okay, so 400. Let's do one more, the closest area or closest distance. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay, so far, there's more there. Um, yeah, I, I meant to do the artillery attack first, but. Um, Yeah, this guy definitely got hurt. Need to return and set yourself up near this guy, or maybe I should get this guy over here first and then set up. Okay. All right, let's get this guy's. Metal them down a bit. Um, Alright, a deal of duel. No matter. Okay, so can we um, hope to drive these guys out? I, I don't know about that. Um, I guess we can attack these guys. Yeah, and drive these guys out. Run back to the bridge. Alright. And, uh, yeah, rest up, I think. That's probably the best thing for these guys. And then um, we can go all the way up there if we can. But right now, we are kind of um, in a bit of bind. So I'm going to let's see if I can move anybody here. Yeah, a lot, a lot of cannons, and I understand why um, there are a lot of reinforcements coming because um, these guys in the west is uh, definitely threatening us at every uh, position. So we need to basically hold here, I think, instead of trying to take the hill, because uh, we may not be able to attempt any um, serious attacks. We might get attacked very soon. And this guy's holding, but kind of tenuous. And here, uh, we need to move very quickly as well. Gonna threaten at least one flank and then um, get these guys offline. Yeah, so this guy, anybody can move or this guy could just move on up there. Okay, no problem. 29, 24, 35, wow. They're really prepared. Okay. Yeah, so they're attacking our burn level guys on the creek and this side. Yeah, wow. Okay, so they weren't able to attack right now, but they're like pouring forth, trying to flank us. And I think the objective report said these guys will be attacked in full frontal force by the uh, Union. And um, Nathaniel Bank. I think his uh, aim is to try to break Yule first and then deal with uh, TJ Jackson later in piecemeal style while we want to try to push up and then um, attack in the pincer formation. Okay, so yeah, that's uh, no choice but to attack these guys very close and uh, we need to abandon the idea of um, trying to take the hill. And these guys get attacked too, so thankfully these guys just attacking on the one side of the hill instead of trying to flank us on both sides. And this guy moved a bit, but I think we need to consolidate our um, areas first before doing anything, and then we need to dig in, I think. Um, can I dig in? Yeah. Oh, I cannot dig in. All right. So what can I do? Just be here, and then uh, dig in here. And uh, yeah, this guy's kind of hurt, so I'll not be able to attack right away. Um, okay. Yeah, 
Uh, only thing I can do is to try to um, hit these guys. 28, 26. So I guess I can sort of counter him. One to one. Alright. Can't hit anybody else but this guy. Yeah, they're just raining down shell fire. Yeah, we're going to have to shoot like so many of these guys right away. 23. This is 23 and dug in. May move. And I think this guy could handle this guy by digging in. Um, I'm going to dig in right now. And I think I'm going to just yeah get this guy first. Because they may get more damaged. And uh, yeah, alright. On this side, we need to really push ahead. We set up right here and then um, get these guys rested up. Or can I just, yeah. Daddies, man. Then we need to just use this first. Alright, yeah. Are they moving? Nope, they're not moving. They're not watching. Guys, hurt. Okay, attack into these guys. Kill on their ground. Okay, so we took some supplies and how about these guys? Okay, I think I can push these guys away also. But I think I'm gonna try to push these guys right here once again. Yeah, very aggressive attack toward the other flank. Well, um, okay. Just do that and move up. And with these guys, we'll attack. Um, well, let's start with this. Yeah, so the artillery duo it is. It's a bit longer, so wasn't really hit back. All right, do we have any other artillery here? Yes. Oh. Okay, so any, anybody who can attack? Oh, this guy, yeah. This guy should dig in or something. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna get pretty badly beaten here. Yeah, right there. It's a pretty sore spot for us. They're rushing at us, even fight, but that was pretty bad. Yeah, and they're taking the hill. Okay, so on the right side, well, let's start with the left, which is... Um, yeah, we are kind of flagging here, not doing too well. Um, we try to defend as much as possible, but oh my goodness, look at them. They're like, all like coming in and then trying to... Yeah, it's going to be pretty, pretty nasty. Um, yeah, there's really no way but to do this. Try to stop them from attacking us. And um, yeah, it's pretty bad. Wow. Holy moly, yeah, this is pretty bad. Thirty and eighteen. We get flogged. Uh Okay, can I attack? No. I already spent that. Yeah, we need to defend as much as possible, but I don't know how long we can hold out. So we need to push, uh, I guess, to punish these guys. Get rid of their ground, they're running. Okay. I think they recover in time. Well, we take this. Try to take it. Just rush out. There's no time to waste. 
for me to sweep across before time is up. And I get this guy to um, attack. All so these guys will try to um, yeah, rush toward and then uh, get the camp heal. Okay. Definitely artillery duo happening. Okay, so the last one. Uh, definitely need um, reinforcement. Alright, so the reinforcement is coming on this side. So yeah, no time too soon. 150 men and 630 men. 703 okay definitely we have to retreat next turn and then uh, replace these guys with um, the reinforcements yeah these guys who's going to get beaten back possibly um and you know i like to think that this is all the union have i think this is probably all the union have yeah and just need to um i don't know uh surround them as much as possible Let's see if it's going to work out. I think I should just stay here, yeah, for now. Okay, um, that's it, right? Well, I have this guy. Okay. And digging in, digging in, yeah, everybody digging. Great. Yeah, it's not going to get it's not going to be good. We're gonna get from these guys. Definitely have to get rid of them. And this is yeah. Not good. Not good. Not good. Oh no. How are they holding on? Oh my goodness. Yeah, we are sagging here, but uh, I think there's reinforcements coming in, right? Or is it... Where, where's the reinforcement? It's not coming in? Okay, let's check the reinforcement. Um, where... Let's see. It's 8.30 now. It's, yeah, it should be coming in. Is this some kind of a trick? 8.30. It's 8.30 right now. It's next turn? And this guy will have to... Um, yeah, I guess so. I guess so. Yeah, this is not going to really work out. Wow, look at that. This is not good. Oh boy. Yeah, I speed up. Okay. They might get routed, without question. I might have a chance against this guy. Maybe former line. Hmm. Oh no, we have to see. But we are not doing too well here. Yeah, my goodness. Okay, so we gotta. Alright. Yeah, let's see if I can attack. So, let's choose the. Hmm, this guy. And we have to attack this guy. Yeah, concentrate on firing at this guy first. Same goes here. And try to drive these guys out. Yeah, can have their ground. Okay, so if this guy attack using well. Alright, 
Now we advance um, Jackson here. And then... At ease, man. Rest this, guys. It. That's good. Alright, one cannon off our back. It's a small consolation though because we get wiped out next turn. It's not going to do well here. Yeah, we get routed. We are getting routed. We are getting just come out. Oh boy, that was pretty bad. That was pretty bad. Okay, we held there. Okay, finally. Yeah. These guys arrived so we can uh, relieve some of these troops. Yeah, it doesn't really look good, but finally we can do something with these guys. Yeah. So, how about charging these guys? here and the most of these um i have to probably use this first and then remove these guys now and then all right yeah and all the other cannons might have to move Okay, sure, just attack them, then I will anyways. Yeah. They're running, routed. And now we try to get this guy next turn. Okay, you can probably make them run too. We are gaining some ground on the right side now these guys unfortunately they cannot train the cannons on this side of the battle so they have to move and they move around these hills so that uh, we can no, sir. Oh, i cannot move right there we need to go onto the road i guess Let's see if i can uh... yeah it's a pretty um dire situation but if i move the cannons and then they're able to go there as quick as possible uh, I can probably attack. Uh, okay. Oh, he's shot. All right. No problem. For this guy, um, yeah, I think they should also move. They've already shot, so that's it. Right. And this guy can train their shot onto this guy to help our guys. All right. So what is happening over here? Uh, yeah. So these guys, uh, I'll be able to defend against this guy. Now, who is the strongest guy over here? Yeah, this guy's a problem, so I think I need to get this guy. And these guys will have to... Uh, damn it. <laughs> Do we have a chance here? Do I have a chance? Um, maybe I have a chance. Yeah, this guy will get attacked pretty severely. Um, I can try to get these guys uh, down a bit before I try to defend, but now this guy should... Um... Wait. Yeah, we have to set up. And, um, okay. They can attack right away, but they can at least protect this uh, artillery unit. It's going to... let's see. Yeah, I think this guy will be able to do well. Uh, at least able to defend. This guy is in the back. It's a reserve. So I think we need to hit this guy. Yeah, 17. Yeah, still pretty bad, but... I think I can move these guys up and then uh, help defend this area. More or less. Okay, so these guys are from... They are LA Tigers, yeah, the Wheat Tigers. 
Louisiana Tigers, I think. Um, so they will be pressing to attack right away. And here, I think they're able to also um, try to, um, okay, let's see, 21, 10, 18. They're probably to dig in once again. And let's see, we have our Taylor here. Yeah, he's involved in the last battle as well. And uh, just checking out, yeah, so this is CR Witch reinforcement that just came. And checking out some of the Union guys. All right, so we have Donnelly, Murphy, all these other guys. Doesn't even have a name, battery leader, zero. Wow. And uh, yeah, this guy's a problem. I think I move out a bit because I don't want to get face full of these guys' canisters next turn. And these guys could also move, but then I, yeah, just be on the outskirts. This guy could uh, need some rest. I don't know why he lost so many. Maybe he got hit. This guy got hit. Okay. Yeah, so these guys could be in danger from the Peabody, Mr. Peabody here. And I think he's back with vengeance after getting um, defeated in the last battle. Okay, um, we can still hold on, I think, against this guy. It's pretty similar. And um, and I think I can still move these guys around. Um, yeah, I think I can move this guy right here. Which, uh, good reinforcement, I can say that. And we have some um, artillery still. I think I can fire at some of these guys. And I think I'm going to fire at... Um, this guy because I don't think they'll be able to reinforce themselves because there's so many other troops now surrounding them so they have to make a decision here and I will also try to protect or you know get the cannons back up I think um, yeah I think they're able to fire but who knows they don't want to run anymore okay how about this guy so uh, should I dig in first yeah I think so I don't think I'll be able to battle these guys yet uh, this guy will try to hold on, but yeah, it's really limited right now. And maybe it could be possible these guys will try to come back and then open up, you know, the road so that they won't be boxed in after we move all these guys. And these guys are pretty, um, I mean, they are not really broken down, but you can see they're in this kind of sorry shape after being involved in a lot of battles. So we're gonna have to see and uh, whether we can defend this uh, area first before trying to move and then um, attack or box in these guys. Hopefully I can make them surrender in certain um, situations. This guy also should move next turn. All right. Okay. Yeah, so we want to arrest these guys and also... Yeah, not gonna really move. Just try to defend. Same goes for that guy. This guy's in trouble, he got attacked multiple times, so maybe... Uh, okay... And they got attacked, definitely. Yeah, I think I need to save this guy. Yeah, this guy could have withstand, I think, multiple attacks, so that's why I'm moving these guys to the back, and maybe next turn he's going to recover, hopefully. Yeah, you was gonna stay there. And what's this guy? Yeah, alright. This guy? Oh, alright, I can make a shot. Hmm, how about I um Okay, how about I shoot at this guy, try to help this side. And that's it. Yep, hopefully more reinforcements will come. This guy's running, but they're gonna come back. Wow, wow, okay, so they delivered a full shot there. I was afraid of that. Same here. Yeah, they're coming back, you see. Yeah, they're trying to come back. And Virginia reinforcements arrived. I don't know from where. Uh, I don't know. Okay, so I think the biggest thing right now is to get these guys to the back. First of all, because they're not in a position to fight. Right, yeah. I think that's what we should be doing. And then... Concentrate the right fort on this guy. So, okay, so this guy's arrived. Not really a big um, amount of reinforcement. Good. These guys all like digging in. 
Okay, uh, see if I can fire this guy. They have to recover. They have to recover. No, this guy can shoot though. Yeah, so let's drive these guys out one by one. 14, I think I can attack some of these guys. Um... Oh, they're moving. Yeah, wind in this position. All right. So this guy probably should march, but um, right now they cannot do anything uh, in terms of going over here to try to help this side. Okay, so I think I'm going to just continue with this battle, dueling battle here. Can I fire at this guy? Nope, I can't. I need to move. No, sir. Okay, they're kind of stuck. This guy could fire at this guy. Yes, what we are also doing is we are trying to engage this guy so that they run out of ammo or something to shoot with. And I think I'm gonna have to cross back here. But first, I think I need to attack with these two guys, definitely. So let's start with uh, the strongest one. And hopefully, we get to drag these guys out. Nope, nope, couldn't do it. But we did take them down a bit. Uh, yeah. Come back, and they're able to rest up a bit, I think. Man. Okay, yeah, so uh, seems like we are um, we trying to bring these guys forward to battle, but seems that we are never really having a lot of success here because uh, some of the cannons really cannot fire right now because they're all beat up. Uh, yeah, maybe you can just, just concentrate fire on this guy and then uh, drive these guys out of this position. I think I can do that. Yeah, we just have to advance a bit here, and here as well. And um, you can probably um, get these guys also moving to follow this guy. So we're gonna try to do that while we recover. And this guy we need to recover. Stone house, I don't know whether it's built with stone or something, but... Um, yeah, has served pretty well to safeguard this guy, our healer, or someone else. Jay Eccles, yeah. This guy will uh, provide other flanking maneuver to try to protect our um, protect these guys here, getting these uh, cannons offline, and I think definitely helped a lot in trying to get these guys um, some added insurance. And uh, these guys will have to rest. And uh, I think I will try to um, yeah, I think I try to stick together. And guard this area. Well, these guys will. Yeah, this guy has only one cannon shot, so I mean, can probably force things a bit by moving here. And you can see, yeah, a lot. Or let me just try to see if I can move um, up here. Yeah, I think it'd be better. I think it'd be better to see if I can. Oh, okay, I can't really uh, see the range, but I think it's going to be a lot better. No, sir. Not no, sir, but yes, sir. This guy can move up, but stay. And yeah, I think these two guys will try to attack now. I think we can drive these guys out. Yeah, yeah. all right. Good, we got a lot of supplies back, which is good. And now we can uh, try to attack these guys. We move up here and rest, I guess. Yeah. Next up is going to be this guy as he draw up another um, fight here, and then uh, we try to close up these guys, bottleneck them around this this area. Um, but then I really need to, yeah, I really need to make sure that these guys um, are able to move up their cannons quick enough. I think they can. Yeah, get this hill. Just need to get this hill. And uh, this guy can move until later, and this guy has a few more shots left. And now this guy, Langhorn, pretty uh, dependable guy, it seems. 
is going to move um, up here. Yeah, and then I set up here to help defend this space. This guy has been pretty strong, 511 men strong, and this guy has not been doing too well, although his firepower is comparable. Unfortunately, this guy cannot help because um, because of wood in the way. Alright, so checking out the... Wow, okay. Yeah, I think this guy really needs to defend against these two guys. Yeah. Um, hmm. Uh, I think next turn. This guy... Yeah. So, yeah, you was kind of you know, better position than a few turns before thanks to the reinforcements that I was wondering about all the time oh, okay, see our reach I need to move this guy we're going to occupy a stone house here alright, yeah, you rest up bring all the stats to the nearby units okay yeah, so they keep firing, my gosh and they're doing a bit of a... Wow, the cavalry is here. This is not good, folks. Oh my goodness, the cavalry have arrived. 16 and 3. Okay, all the forest and wet ski. But we really need to get these guys off our backs. And uh, yeah, we need to protect. And, uh, yeah, okay. Gotta dig in. Do you have any shots left? Hopefully not anymore. <laughs> oh, he, um, yeah, he didn't shoot last turn because he was out of the shells. Okay, so let's see, um, what turn is it now? Turn 8, okay. So Calvary's arrived from north, and we have more um, of these guys down there. Right, so that's good news. Can you fire now? Anybody? Can you fire anybody? No. Can you fire at this guy? Nope. Let's keep resting. Keep resting. Get your strength up a bit. But this guy can fire. Let's see what I can... Yeah, I think I can target this guy. That was a pretty good shot. I think the RNG was definitely favorable for us there. And... Um, yeah, alright. So we need to attack this guy. And keep pushing. Pushing up the hills here. Yeah, just defeat these guys one by one. Yeah, I think we'll be able to do it. So let's... Um, I think I can move up here. 18, 15, 34. Okay, start with um, this guy. Going to be rather difficult, but dealing with their ground. Good. Wow, alright. Yeah, it was kind of even fight, but they had enough. And we're going to kind of press on ahead. Um oh no, actually that's not good. No, no, no. No sir. Uh yeah, okay, so this guy's flagging, so we're gonna attack once again. They're on top of the hill. Okay. I don't know whether that's a good thing or bad thing. And, uh... Oh, we can basically shoot at the same time. Um... Both okay, units. But they might run away. Okay. And we keep the, yeah, stalemate here. Well... Okay, what can we do? Can we, um... Use this area to... Yeah, I think I'm gonna just move up a bit here. Now that these guys arrive, we need to, I think, maybe use this road to bring these guys up and around toward Winchester. I think it might be a nasty surprise for Nathaniel Banks. Okay, so this guy... Uh, wow, yeah, we're in kind of a sticky situation here. Oh, we got some of our own uh, cavalry. Hmm, I wonder what this means. Flornoy? Wow, okay. Maybe we can use Flornoy to attack this guy right away. We can also use HP probably. Yeah, I think so. Maybe it's probably easier. Yeah, alright. Yeah, it's definitely easier. And I don't want to waste all these guys. So we're gonna move the cavalry up here. It's kind of interesting that the reinforcements have um, are all right at the same time. 
And uh, it seems that these guys, I might be able to drive these guys out. Let's try with these guys first. Yeah, okay. And then, oh, okay, that's good because um, this guy is riding the... Uh, I guess we can drive these guys out a bit further. And then um, route them. Yeah, they routed. it. So, no cannon support for them, I guess. And we'll move these guys where they were. You know, these guys, for example. And then uh, fire at them from above. And we have our own little defensive area here um, next turn. Yeah, I'm not gonna move right away. I think we can move this guy up the top of the hill though. Although this guy's probably spent and I cannot attack a chicken coop. I might be able to serve as a pretty good guard for this artillery. And these guys are now trying to rest up a bit, yeah, and then... Um, and we're going to attack, as I said, we're going to attack. So this guy, we have to rest up. Second line of defense, and there's one more guy here that Addies, could, that's going to rest up. Yeah, so health is really bad, as you can see, they're all like spent. Same goes for this guy. Right. Okay, let's hope for the best. Give a big round. And you can take these guys right away. Um, I think it's uh, worth trying. Yeah, I think it's worth trying. Oh wow, okay. You didn't expect them to run. But now we can make them run all at the same time. Um, we can also try to surround them a bit, if that's possible. These guys are not doing too well. And then if I attack directly, then I think these guys might have to think about running. No, too risky. No, sir. Although they ran, because uh, we are kind of lacking the firepower, 12 to 15, so we let them rest a bit. Or uh, we can even try to flank them and then um, apply more pressure. So let's do that then. Let's move these guys up here. And move these guys up here. Apply some more pressure that is. And um, these guys could... Um... Wow. Right, I think you can attack these guys. No, sir. Oh, actually, uh, I, I said um, yeah, rest a bit At here. Ease, man. I think I'll rest. And these guys will come up here. And that's already. That's good. They're from Virginia. Okay. So are we done? I think we are done. Oh, finally they can move. Alright. Uh yeah, move up here. And how about this guy? They can also try to limber up next turn. This guy could be vulnerable. Okay, so we're actually doing really well. Yeah. I definitely need to get rid of this guy. They suffered a lot more. Oh wow, look at that. They're right in force. Their attack didn't work, so they're kind of running now. And we have more reinforcement. Look at that. They're coming up pretty strongly. Get our positions ready. We're gonna get hit pretty bad. No question about it. They're trying to protect Winchester, I bet. And we have to use all these hills in order to fire at them. Let's see if I can fire at some of these guys right now. Yeah, I can definitely fire. But we'll bide our time. Yeah. And uh, use these guys to protect. Do we have enough men? We get this guy up here first. And, um, hmm. Dick, we get this guy over here. And let's see if I can get this guy's dog in. Um, yeah, I think this would be better. I'll take this guy. No shells. Oh, okay. Yeah, they'll come back up the hill. And yeah, they're running back. They might come back though. I'll run back here. 
And yeah, I think we need to surround these guys now because we don't want them to. I think we drive these guys out and then surround with these couple units so that they can surrender. I think we can do that. We just have to push these guys out. We have this uh, some of these cannons ready, hopefully, yeah. And how about now? Can I attack anybody here? No. I think these guys will have to rest more. They have to rest also. And this guy, well... I cannot fire it. Yeah, I cannot fire at that guy, so I just have to attack this guy. They're not doing too well either. Can you attack this guy? I don't know, maybe. I'd rather just tie these guys down while we do our stuff. Okay, so maybe I should try to go up here. Yeah. We'll try to attack them next turn. Alright. Yeah, I think definitely should attack using these guys. But is there any cannon that I can use? Yeah. Okay. Alright, one more and we'll attack. I think this is time to do it. Yeah, so 14. And we can surround these guys, hopefully, and then get this guy to surrender. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, we can do any number of these attacks. But then let's start with this guy. They're dug in, so gotta be careful. Hmm, I don't know about that. 17. Um, hmm. Oh, no, damn it. Sir. Okay, good. Alright, so we are rushing at these guys, and then I think these guys will be the first. Okay, just make them surrender. Yep, so they surrendered. I think we're gonna get a lot of supplies. Alright, so we gained a lot of supplies for sure. 803 yeah that's a lot i think and we're going to round up and then uh try to attack them as much as possible because i don't want them to come back and then harass us while we are busy taking winchester yeah so um it's going to be a um, great undertaking for sure because these guys are now arriving from north and the uh, cavalry is pretty fearsome too uh, but then we have all these uh, units now with the cannons some of these guys are not really, you know, up to fighting. They're really bad off. But I think I can bring some of these cannons and then uh, bombard the heck of this area. Uh, that's my hope anyway. While push these guys into one place and then combine our forces and see what happens. Looks like we can also use this road to attack their rear. Um, definitely we have to use marching formation to get there quickly. And here we have set up some, yeah, I mean, we are, we are able to deliver some good shot, you know, at least on the, uh, on this area, although I can probably move, yeah, I can probably move the cannons around here in order to really, um, let's see if I can move this guy here, yeah, no, actually not, that's not good, I'm not so sure, but I have to uh, think about, um, this kind of stuff next turn yeah so if i set up my cannons here then definitely be able to fire down at winchester but then it's going to be vulnerable to any counter attacks that might happen these guys hopefully will be um, able to still fight uh, some of these guys are not really in a good condition so i think there'll be no danger of being surrounded but i really want to get this guy yeah i really want to get this guy next all right, so what can I do here? Let's move these guys over this side. Yeah, and also these guys could... Um, wow, look at that. That's amazing distance. I think I need to move this no, guy as sir. well. Oops. Yeah, get this guy over here. And just going to have a look around here. Yeah, I think this is a good area to... 
Wow, look at that. There's a lot of cavalry. Yeah, but most of them are not that powerful, but these guys are pretty dangerous. And uh, yeah, this guy's running 13, 13, 17. Okay. 10. All right. So we'll be able to recover. Make sure that this guy rests up. They can probably move back here if they want to, but I think this is a good place. Alright, so they're gonna rest up there. And let's see if I can move anybody else. Oh, I can move this guy and then make them run, perhaps. Uh, I don't know about this guy. I think this guy should rest. At ease, man. This guy could move up. And this guy could definitely attack this guy. Yeah, I think so. And there is another um, opportunity to maybe surround this guy. Uh, I'm not so sure, but this guy's a leader guy, so could be pretty variable. Okay. And Posey here. 13. He might have to rest. This guy will move up here. Posey, I think. It could move up here then. Yeah. Because um, I like to have a bit of a natural cover. As you can see, two and the uh, height advantage could be useful. And this guy also could act as a bit of a backup force to punch through some of the defenses or the counter attack. Yeah, that's going to, st going to stay for now. Oh man, definitely we have to rest. Stonewall Jackson recovering somewhat. Stay there for a while. And this guy. Well, um, see if I can fire some of these guys. Yeah, I think I can. Um, hmm. I'm more afraid of these guys. Right. So definitely can attack Winchester from there. Good to know. Yeah, I don't know about attacking these guys right now. Um, I think we are in good position, so we're gonna keep that. This guy, we definitely have to rest. Yeah, but I like to make sure that at least these guys kind of um, Addies, man. follow the rest of the army. So, reinforcements, we really simply move up, march up. I think um, here. This guy will march up, um, let's see, yeah, why not, here, they're like our second line of defense, still marching, so uh, less attrition. Yeah, a lot of units, a lot of units to contend with here, uh, yeah, we need to move, but to shed this guy. Yeah, just set the strength a bit further. Okay, so we are ready for the Union counterattack, possibly from Winchester. Hopefully our defense is enough to handle first turn before we can set up the cannons and allow these guys to help by using this road. Yeah, I mean, it was pretty bad, the early goings, especially for you all, because the Union had advantage in manpower and then also the the cannons here kind of kept bombarding us, but after um, Stonewall Jackson was able to take these guys out and then the reinforcements arrived, um, they were able to control things. Yeah, we just sweep across and then see uh, whether we can take Winchester next episode. Yeah, so this has been another episode of Civil War Journals 2. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you can join me next time. Please stay tuned.